Welcome to this lesson and it's about changing negative indices to positive indices and or exponents, negative exponents to positive exponents. So 2 to the minus 1, all it is is a short way of writing 1 over 2 to the positive 1 and the final answer you would write for that would be just 1 over 2. Another example, if we have something like x to the negative 2, that is just a short way of writing 1 over x to the power 2, or 1 over x squared. And another example, if I have w to the 9 minus 10, then that would be 1 over w to the power 10. So that's all there is to that part. It gets a little bit trickier when you have things like this something like 2x to the minus 5 and this is really 2 times by x to the minus 5 and that is equal to 2 times 1 over x to the 5 2 is really 2 over 1 and then multiplying fractions top numbers together 2 times 1 equals 2 and on the bottom 1 times anything is just that anything so we end up with 2 on x to the 5 so another example, if you have 5x to the minus 3, any time you end up with that kind of answer, really all that happens is the we end up with this. So x to the minus 3, the x cubed goes on the bottom, and the 5 being a whole number will be on the top, just like the 2 was in the last example. And even if you have a fraction like a half, x to the minus 4, Four, that would be just showing the steps this time a half times 1 on x to the 4 and then we end up with 1 on the top and 2x to the power 4 on the bottom like that so anything with a negative power will become 1 over that same thing to the positive of that power and depending on what number you're multiplying it by as to what or where those two numbers in or what that number will become so that's how you change negative indices or negative powers or negative exponents to positive exponents. And that's about it for this video. I'll see you in the next one.